Well, hello there. It is Kid Friday. We do this show because you're a kid in a digital world. I'm Dave and uh, still working on this uh, semi-program that... Oh, you guys are in the green room yeah. today. Yeah. Are you uh, about to go on... Uh, uh, Ellen, th is that what's going on? You're the next guest on no, Ellen? No, Ellen's green room isn't green. Oh, it isn't? I know that. Oh, I didn't, I didn't know that. All right, we got Hannah, and so we got uh, almost 16-year-old Hannah, and, hey. uh, and officially... 13-year-old Zoe. All right, it is Kid Friday. We're going to be talking. Well, you know, we do tech stuff for kids, but then, of course, it uh, we end up all who, who knows where. But what is the flap with Flappy Bird? One of the coolest uh, presentations of packaging I've ever seen for an electronic gadget. You guys will love this. And oh, so much <laughs> more. Ooh, sorry. Oh, you all right there? Oh, well, let's get going. It's Kid uh, El Friday. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Let's get this party started. Right. Yeah, I'm a kid. I love computers. I have an iPod. I'm a gadget freak. I like to play with my display. I do it every day. I have awesome technique. Yeah, I'm a kid Friday. Sorry. Hey, Kid Friday is brought to you by Story Cub. If you have a younger brother or sister, uh, you know, Story Cub, if you're a parent, you'll, you'll love this because what is Story Cub? Video versions of children's picture books. You can check out the story of the day free, a new story every day for free and you can watch it all day till you go wacko it is the story of the day on story cub you can get the free story cub app in itunes and the google play store or you can just head on over to storycub.org and watch it right there or there's and there's also links to where you can get the apps for free that is story cub thanks for being a sponsor on the old kid friday <laughs> So what is... Um, can I say what Zoe just whispered to me? Yeah. She goes, what? She goes. did you know there was a baby kangaroo born one inch big? Really? Is that a big secret? or One inch big? Yeah. Where'd you read that? I don't remember. Hey, Zoe, why... I think she made it up. No, Zoe, I no, um, I'll find it somewhere. We're already, get, we're already getting off the beaten path. Hey, Zoe, why don't you read uh, what you just wrote that you uh, read me before we well, started no, the show? I don't want to. Can you please? Yeah, go I don't ahead. Want to. No, it's no, it won't make no, sense. No, she doesn't want to read it. You I sure? don't want to read it. You don't want to read it? No. Oh. How about you, Han? You want to read it? Um, no. Okay. Why would it be any different, Zoe, reading it than me? Oh, I just thought Can she didn't Zoe want to. I read thought maybe it? she just didn't want to read it. Okay. No, I just don't want to read it because it's, it's not. Okay. Now, uh, when I told, it was either one of you or both of you or somebody about uh, the old. The old Flappy Bird. I said, oh, Flappy Bird. Did you know away. there's like a billion fake Flappy Birds? There's like Flippy Bird and there's mm -hmm. Flappy Bird Pro and there's Flappy Bird and like Flappy, Flappy, like. So the guy, so in case you don't know what the old Flappy Bird is, uh, Hannah, tell us a little bit about Um, Flappy, Flappy bird, bird is simply a game where you try and get the bird through the pipes and the bird is 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 like um affected by gravity and so every time you tap it it goes up and then you gotta get through the tubes mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. and what's going on now believe it or not and this is this is the crazy stuff if you ask me uh what is going on is that people who have you know you can't get flappy bird anymore and uh the guy who developed flappy bird said look it's just an addictive game and he was he was making fifty well, thousand dollars a day i read that this. he like couldn't handle all the money which is kind of like stupid because like you can just donate it or something he's got other games as well uh creating revenue but, but they don't have no one uses them but flappy bird was making fifty thousand dollars a day but there's still ads on flappy bird what? No, there's not. Yeah, there is ads. No, okay, let's take a look, Zoe. Let's there's, on the new one. There's not. Get well, Flappy Bird. Let's let, let, first off, let's say this: uh, Flappy Bird, you cannot get anymore. So people who uh, have Flappy Bird on their phone are putting their phone up on eBay and selling them. And there's been a kind of a couple kind of uh, kooky ones, but uh, there's been um, just crashed. There's been some well, amazing. Be an ad. 
There's, there, there, people are doing it. All right. So uh, there's the thing is, you, Hannah, you mentioned uh, replacement for Flappy Bird. However, you have to be very, very cautious because there are a lot of fake ones that are similar that have malware on it and uh, um like it, apps infect, yes yes oh it's what not, is no, that for so, stores. so you need to be careful Those what is this is an ad zoe what what do you got in an ad? it doesn't an i just ad. saw an ad it said wild on store. it that's not an ad. no that's still an ad yeah, if it adds <laughs> coming on on the app it, it is it is an ad yes yeah so no i'm right. don't read stuff okay let's so like stupid. keep playing this and see an ad, another ad another ad huh Oh, now the best way, up, the best way to no, avo- avoid some of those ads on some of these games your, oh, is wow, to put goodness. it in airplane mode, and then uh, it will stop downloading them. All right. So um, according to a security so firm, Sophos, they have uh, discovered that <coughs> that people. Oh, are, oh what was that? That was, that was an ad. And welcome. Back. No, that yeah. wasn't. That was an ad for a car. That people are trying to it? take advantage of the Shopping old flappy bird shop going right away. And talk. Especially in the Android store, the trouble is that games, in some cases, contain uh, stuff you really don't want and force users to send a text message to a given number, effectively giving the creators of these fake uh, games all they need to uh, exploit users. So be very, very careful. Um, Another security firm, Microtrend, uh, also said that they've discovered a bunch of fake Android Flappy Bird apps spreading online. And uh, so if you see something, fla- first off, Flappy Bird is gone. So if you see something that says the official Flappy Bird, get it now, it's most likely a, a fake, and they're going to try and just steal your information. So you don't want to do that. Uh, and so people are on eBay with selling their iPhones uh, that have Flappy Bird already loaded on, and they're, they're going for some some money. It's very Not odd. Not really. Don't do it. It's very odd. It's very, it very is cool. very odd because that... It's like it's odd. Yeah, well, I will say this. Don't uh, definitely uh, do not uh, delete Flappy Bird from uh, if you already have it in case you want to use it again and play with it because you, you will not be able to download it again. And if you think you can and someone says you can, it's uh, most likely a hoax, fake, phony, and baloney. Got that? Yeah. All right. Hey, before I forget, I want to go like this and like this. Look at that. A little rain uh, out there. And uh, we want to thank a new sponsor, The Tech Geek. And you can go to thetechgeek.com and check out some of the, the geeky tech stuff from The Tech Geek. I like that logo, huh? Look at that. Yeah. That guy has got a, a tie on. And, uh, and some geeky glasses. Exactly. Oh! The Tech Geek. I see his eyes. Oh, and uh, what you can do is go on Facebook, too. Go ahead and like the old Tech Geek page. And while you're there, like the old Kid Friday page, because uh, someday we'll, we'll we'll do something with it. All right, uh, okay, so there's that. And should we get rid of the rain? Oh, I'm going to get rid of the rain. All right. Um, so, Zoe, uh, what app have you been using this past week? That um, None. You're on YouTube a lot, aren't you? I kind of noticed you, you were watching. What were you watching the other can day? Can I talk about something? Yeah, well, hold on for one second. Weren't you, what were you watching the other night? I was like, I don't know. You, uh, you were watching something. You were oh, you were telling. Oh, you were telling me about this makeup uh, or this girl who has, who's making a lot of money on you or has a ton of uh, oh, followers everyone, on YouTube. Who's that? Not followers, subscribers. Mac Barbie subscribers. 07. What? Mac Barbie 07. Mac? Everyone, everyone knows about her. So, she's like a line of Aeropostale. Really? Like she's. Yeah, like she's making bank. From her air She's making bank. All right, Han, what do you what do you okay. there? So at school we use like uh Google Google Drive. Mm-hmm. And I think Google Drive is a really like great thing to have, like because so First it's basically off, like hey, it's hey, basically hold, like hold, 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 okay. I'm gonna explain what it is. Yeah, no, that's what you're gonna before, ask. Before before you huh, before you tell. I'm I'm gonna make a sound like a like a buzzer every time you say the word like. Yeah, All you right. say that a lot. You talk so like you're I, like. I'm gonna go. Eh. That's gonna talk be the buzzer. Like your phone All right. Like. No. Well, I'm gonna talk normally. It's very yeah. You, you, know, you slow down and have to think about it. It's tough. I, it's not easy. I know. I know. So you like? I'll, I'll help you. How about that? I'll fill it in for you. No, please no, just don't. don't. Do what you just want. let me no, talk. Okay. It doesn't matter. Like. It does. It does. Okay, go ahead. Go ahead. 
So tell me, so tell us about Google Drive because it is it's incredibly valuable. So it's basically like um, <laughs> that was like. a, that was an intentional like. No, it was not intentional. It, you can't oh, not put similar. another word in it. Oh, you're saying it's similar to? Yeah. Okay, I got you. It's okay. basically like Word or pa- there's a pa- there's it's like PowerPoint or um, spreadsheets or Open Office and it's it, like that, yeah. yeah it's like any of those. Mm-hmm. But um, I think it's really handy because so I would be on the computer typing up an English essay on like the school computer mm-hmm. and then it'd be like time to leave. It'd be the end of class. And then I have study hall, but I wouldn't want to like go all the way to the media center to do my paper because I just have like a paragraph left. So uh, there's an app for it and you can just sign in and pull up anything that you're working on and you can work on it on your phone. That's pretty cool. And then it can go, it can, th- you don't even need to press save on anything. And it just goes to the, it just goes like the computer. Like. And, and, and it, it'll, it will sync with your uh, other devices, right? Or, or if you're signed into yeah. your Google account. Well, yeah, it, yeah. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. So, so what, what, so it, what do you, what are you actually using it for in school or how, how, again? Any paper I have to do in school. And it has, uh, you know, because I haven't used it in a while. It has. Uh, does it have a spell check and all that stuff? Um. Yeah. Yeah. It yeah. does. It does. Yeah. Okay. Wow. That's pretty cool. I was going to put the the uh, the logo up for Google Drive if I could, and uh, I think I can grab it real quick here, so you know what it looks like. But uh, you, one thing about it uh, that you have to remember: any Google product that you use. It is taking the information so it can market you in a better way. So if you're writing a report on, what, what, what were you just writing a report on? Um, the Fourteenth Amendment. Okay. So, oh, you know what? It didn't save it for some reason. Okay. So it. So let's say you're. Well, I don't know about the Fourteenth Amendment, but uh, if you if you are doing an email in Google, if you are right, using a Google service, if you are doing anything similar, any, any Google product, uh, you're basically giving them permission to use that, to scan your whatever you're writing, even if it's a personal email, and uh, all of a sudden it's interesting because you'll see ads pop up and you're like, wow, how did they know that I was in, into that? So, you know, if I'm writing uh, someone, hey, I think I'm going skiing this oh, weekend. Oh, I know. Like, and, then, and then there's like the ads. Yeah, exactly, yeah. exactly. So they're targeted yeah. ads. So, you know, if I write, hey, like you, hey, do you want to go skiing this weekend? You and there will uh, be so uh, all of a sudden, boom, for skiing. you know, yeah, you know, buy, you know, hey, ski boots on sale or whatever it may be. So it's it, it follow along with it. And especially in, in search, too, you know, if you're searching for something in Google, all of a sudden, you'll find ads popping up for similar items, if not the same item. So, um, but that's that's kind of cool. Uh, can I show you guys what I think is probably the cool, coolest packaging I have ever seen? All right, Sony has uh, they have a new Walkman out, and Hannah, you. Um, what is what would be this Walkman? Well, well, we've, I'm going to show you the picture in just a second. But Hannah, one thing that you always um, seem to 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 try and, and I don't know what it is it appeals to you. How about that? Uh, are items that are waterproof, right? Um. Yeah, you want it under water, water. Well, like a waterproof camera. camera, like that's about it, though. Yeah. Well, check this out. Sony's new Walkman is waterproof, and check out this packaging. Look, it comes in a water bottle. So it comes in water. There's water filled in it. with water. What yes, it is a water bottle. It is and 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 it is That's a. That's weird. It comes in a water bottle. Can I see what it looks like? Because I think a Walkman is kind of like I don't think anyone's gonna buy it really. Well, here, here. How much is it? And Let me show stuff? you. I'll show you another picture. Hold on here. Check this out. All right, and look at that. It's like a, it's like a water machine. You can drink the water. Look, it's, you know. It's, you Ew! I don't think bottle. I'd want to drink the water, but okay. This is this is. Uh, I've never seen this before. Sony's taking quite. Oh, that's a next step. To like Coke and stuff. They're demonstrating uh, how a waterproof oh. their new Walkman is. And the Walkman comes packed inside water bottles. And how much is it and stuff? Well, yeah, we get it. We get which it. are filled with water. And we now, but I want to see what it actually looks like and what, like, you know. The, well, okay. So the water bottle. Well, first off, it's like headphones, but it has, uh, it has all the inf- all the stuff right inside the, uh, 
uh, right inside the headphones, which is cool. So it's really small. So oh, so, so, so if but it's you, like a then it would be yeah. like um. So check this out here. If you look, it would oh, be oh, you probably can't see that too like much. an iPod Shuffle. Well, but it's yeah, it's built into the where the, the headphones are. Um, and so what you're looking at right there, it's not like there's a something a big something else. That, that, that's what it is. So they introduced it at the Consumer Electronics Show in January, and it's an MP3 player, and, and, and they're really promoting it to swimmers, especially, and anyone who's uh, going underwater. Uh, so it's pretty darn neat. They've, uh, they put a vending machine in uh, gyms and swimming pools in New Zealand to kind of check it out and test it out. That's what, that's what the, that other picture How was. much does it cost? Um, that is a good question. How much does it cost? Um, they're not, I don't know. That's a good well, question. Well, it has to be cheaper than the iPod Shuffle, right? I, I don't know. I, it is, it's the Walkman, it's the NWZ, da, 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 yucky, da, da, da. Um, I'll, I'll look it up. I'll look it up. This girl came up to me and she was like, is your calculator waterproof? And I'm like. No. And uh, what did you what did you say, Zoe? I said no. She really? Said, oh. Well. Yeah. So it's not waterproof. Because you just need to do your math underwater. Is that what you're Why contending? Why would they make a waterproof calculator? You're not going underwater with a calculator. You're contending it's not underwater. It's uh, not waterproof calculator. Uh, maybe you want to go at the bottom of the to- bottom of the pool and work on a little algebra, a little a little bit of math. Uh, no. 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 Okay. Uh, let me see if I can find. So you want to know how much this uh, Walkman deal is? Huh? Yeah. Right. Uh, hundred bucks, ninety nine dollars. Mm. I'll show you again. It's not going to do well. I'll show you again. I'll show you the. Uh, I like this uh, vending machine kind of thing. Uh, there you go. One hundred, one hundred dollars. You can buy these. What a, have you ever seen packaging? Your know, packaging has become so important. Sometimes the packaging costs a lot more than the product, and it was. It's really been driven by Apple. Uh, very uh, strict quality or you know guidelines on on packaging uh but um, is this a water bottle reusable yeah it's a real water bottle you can drink the water out of it and you can uh take your your headphones right out so of it. wait is it cold water yeah it's in a vending machine i think that's a refrigerated vending machine right there oh weird huh weird is that cool i like it it's kind of expensive like it's a good idea for swimmers but I don't think every swimmer is gonna want to pay that much. Like I'd, I'd have hundred dollars. You, you yeah. don't have to a cord ha- dangling down. Okay, all right. Well, no, because I mean, I don't know. Well, I'll just I, I just thought I'd mention it anyway. I feel like Philip. I feel like Michael Phelps. Like when you want to make a run for the border, that's what Mom always says when we go to Taco Bell. Have you guys been watching the Olympics? At, by the way, at all? At all? Um, yeah. Uh, have you? Oh, you haven't. Yeah, a little bit. There's, there's some I've been watching a lot of skiing and snowboarding just because that's what's on. Uh, and some ice skating. The U.S. versus uh, the Russians in hockey. Uh, quite a game. Quite a, quite a game. All right. Uh, oh, yeah. I heard this guy targeting. He's like to this other guy. Hey, you see the hockey game? You see the big shootout? They had a shootout? Yeah. Who's, where'd, you, where, where'd you hear this? Or Target. Okay. Who Let, won? Let's move on. Who uh, won? Uh, the U.S. won Woo! in... Uh, in a shootout, who yeah, is it, it was a long against? Shootout. And and just so you know, Hannah, uh, the uh, the guy it's snowing right now. The the, the guy who uh, the guy who uh, won the shootout for the American team is from the very state that we live in. Really? Yeah, yeah. I grew it's, up. Does he play for the Wild? No, he plays for the St. Louis Blues, but uh, mm-hmm. he's uh, he's from he's from our state. Uh, so, mm, what else can we talk about? Quiz up. You guys like quiz so wait, up a lot. So wait, did USA hockey team win gold? Uh, no, they they are going on. The the they're going on in the round. They're playing the Czechs, I believe. Oh. The next round there. I don't play quiz up anymore. Do you? No. Uh, quiz up. You don't. Uh, no. A lot. It's so popular. Quiz up uh, is finally. Uh, it updated everything for the iPad. So if you are a quiz up a user, go to the iPad and, and check it out. Uh, can we? Can I talk a little bit about now? I think. Uh, uh, what was the hot dog originally called? It's dried up lavender. The what? Okay, on the okay on the picture that was just up, it said, it said for like one of the oh, questions, Here, what's uh, and dried. Labrador. What was the hot dog originally called? Shepherd's a dried stick. Labrador, shepherd's stick, a dachshund sausage, or a pitwurst? Do you know? 
I think it's green. It's is green. That, That's is that what means. Green. A dachshund sausage, which leads me to believe because there's a lot of controversy. Isn't that dash hound. There's a lot of controversy. What? Yeah, Never mind. Dash there's there's, there's a con- there's a lot of controversy. Some dash people say that the uh, hot dog w- originated in the United States. A lot of other people say it originated in Germany, and I uh, that kind of leans on, on the German side. Uh, I went on my trip. I went on this trip. Uh, I showed you some stuff before when I had to go. I drove Grandpa down to Florida. Right, and I drove Grandpa back from Florida, and we we made sure that we drove quickly through Georgia. Atlanta traffic stinks, but I uh, wanted to get there before the, all that that bad weather stuff. Uh, but I wanted to tell you about a couple things that happened. All right, can I can I yeah. share a couple things? All right, so first off, uh, un- there was an unfortunate major accident. Uh, uh, we were we were driving from Chattanooga, Tennessee to Nashville. And we were stuck in uh, on, on the freeway, not moving at all, not doing anything. And uh, I'm trying to tune into radio to find out what's going on, and I don't know. I can't get anything. Uh, but I used an app to find other drivers who were also stuck in the same situation. And it is a neat app. Uh, unfor- I... I don't want to talk about the accident itself, but there is an app called Waze. And what you do is it is crowdsourced traffic. So when I went on Waze, uh, it, on a map on this highway, it showed different areas of other people who were on Waze. And you can comment to them. There was someone two miles ahead of me. There was someone a mile and a half behind me. And then there was someone else kind of in between. So the person up front... Uh, was kind of, you know, in a better position to know what was going on. Uh, It it turned out that it was six miles of traffic that would not stop at all. I I mean, that that would not move at all. So, you know, (laughs) that would not move at all. What happened? What happened in the accident or what did I do or what? Yeah, what happened in the accident? I don't know, but I, I know that uh, and there was you a helicopter. You don't want to talk about well, it. I will say this, there, and I don't know what the result, but there was a helicopter that did uh, that flew right above me, and I know they uh, airlifted some people to the oh. hospital. So uh, Why don't I you know. want to talk about it? Well, it's, 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 now, on the other hand, I had Grandpa, right? And when he gets hungry, man, he is ornery. So I turned the car around on the highway, and went the wrong way. And you know those little roads where the police go across on the highways? You know, sometimes they oh, set up speed of, traps. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah. So I put my, my emergency flashes on, and first I mapped it out on my iPhone where we wanted to go. I was using Google Maps and, uh, and ended up uh, driving to the other side of the highway and going back about a mile and found another place to go because that was that was uh, we were really stuck for a long time and the temperatures were starting to fall there too so that's one thing and um i, I used spotify just about the entire way back i was surprised at&t had pretty good reception uh out on between i forget how far it was let's see we drove to gainesville then we drove gainesville to st louis that was like 885 miles and then and then st louis back here but uh the only piece of uh you know i showed you that one uh video of those palm trees when i was down in florida yeah so here's kind of the opposite the, the we didn't really didn't run into too much weather because we, we we made sure we beat it but uh in the southern part of where we live in the state we live in uh this was going on and it's hard to tell but there's it was really windy really really windy and you can kind of see the snow it's blowing it's blowing across the, the highway there and uh and the temperature, I think, was about three degrees Fahrenheit. So, uh, but that's that's about the worst of the weather. Not too bad, huh? That is not bad at all. No, that's it's what not. happens here every day. Yeah, yeah it's not not, not too <laughs> bad. That's what happened today, actually. Did you like the end of that, Zoe? Yeah. Huh? <laughs> what ha- what happened today? <laughs> Bless you. Oh, I just popped my ear. What happened today? Nothing. It just. Let me see if this works. Does this work? No, it's both of you guys. All right, never mind. Um, what happened today? It was snowing. 
Oh, yeah, it was, wasn't it? Look at this. Look at this one. Zoe. Uh, okay, okay. All right. So should we move on? We got to wrap it up soon. Oh, we got so much stuff to talk about, including. Well, talk about the Taco soon. Bell article. Really? I want to hear about it. You want to hear about Taco Bell? Yeah. Well, Taco, Taco Bell, Bell up, app will speed up your order. Like. Yeah. Taco Bell announced uh, that uh, they have a new app that will allow customers to place their order and make the payment before leaving your house. And then you can pick up your order faster. Uh, so you head on over to your nearest That's Taco so Bell. That's so good. You know? I'm going to get that app right now. Are you? Yeah. Don't be uh, so stupid. You're going to make you pay well, for okay. it first. But, you know, I mean, I, I got to say. I, you, well, I, no, when we get up there, we're like, oh, my God. Like, oh, so I was like, get this, don't get this, get this. I haven't you know? waited too long for a Taco Bell. Yeah. What I think minutes. they should do is deliver. That, that, would, be, that would be With long. a drone. Huh, so? A drone. No, okay, that's stupid. It is? Okay, my yeah, friend heard about it, and she went on and on about how stupid it is. She was talking about it for, like, 30 minutes. She's like, like, she's like, like, my social studies teacher said that, like, like if he saw it, he would, like, try to take it and, like, crush it or something. And I'm like. What? Is it this app? Uh, I don't know where you're looking. I'm. Wait, is it? A, wait, what does the app look like? Uh, the app, uh, it's called, you want, you want the official word for it? Yeah, Taco Bell app. Uh, da, 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 da. It is called the Taco Bell's mobile. Oh no, it's Taco Bell mobile app. Yeah, but no, let's see. Or Taco Bell app. Uh, no. I think that I think it's just. Uh, I'll tell. I'll see what it is. I really have to. Uh, pro- it's currently in the process of testing an app. Okay. So it doesn't exist. Uh, it may not exist yet. Okay, I'm gonna get this Taco Bell app and just see. Yeah, I think I think. Can I go the, get something to drink real quick? Uh, no, because you always take like no, because uh, we're almost done. Right. You always take like no. I really minutes. need it. Um, do you okay. want this? All right. no, like really badly. Okay, go ahead. No, I don't want that. Go ahead. We'll wait it. for you. No problem. Okay. No problem. Another app that you uh, you might be interested in, and uh, uh, did I? I thought I uploaded the Whoa, this. I guess right not. Up. What? I entered my wrong password. What What app have you been uh, using most uh, this past weekend? The Taco Bell app. The Taco Bell. I'm kidding. App. I haven't gotten it yet. Oh, I want um, to. Um, Candy oh. Crush, the basics. Really? Yeah, really? Candy Crush is. Uh, you're having a lot of problems with that. Uh, you're. you're um, I don't want to use the word addicted, but. Uh, the, I'm not addicted. To, I to... play it like once a day. Do you? Yeah, because you can only play it once a day. No. Oh, okay. Uh, some other can stuff. I... Some other stuff that I want to talk about. Yeah. What? Can I take this off? No. Away. Why? So I can speak into it easier instead of leaning forward? You want to hold it? Yeah. Or you could move the microphone stand closer to you. Do you ever think of that? Ooh, look at her go. There, that's easier. What are you going to say? Hey, everyone, welcome to... Uh, you that's like easier. You're, okay, you like that? Yeah. All right, what do you want to say? Mm-hmm. Anything? No? No. All right. Uh, tell me about this, if you could. Let me find this here. Uh, da, 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 oh, the gosh, so he's not so gonna much. come back. Yeah, well, there's so much. There's so so much. Um, oh, oh gosh, I'm, I I have a uh, plethora of uh, information here. Um, that I no have set use aside. flappy bird phones. Not really flying so high on eBay. All right, let's talk about your favorite stuff. The iWatch. All right. Because uh, everyone thinks the iWatch is coming. They know the iWatch is coming. And, you know, an Apple, Han, they hired, uh, they're, they're becoming more of a lifestyle company. They hired uh, someone from, I forget who it was, a big fashion house in uh, in France. Uh, Did you know that Chipotle, that McDonald's paid Chipotle a lot of money to get the business started? I did not know that. Thank you, though, for... You, did you know that uh, they um, invested? So the iWatch sales during their first year alone uh, are expected to be seventeen point five billion dollars for Apple, and it is everyone's waiting for the for the iWatch. You say there, you say the iWatch. I'm not interested, and I say you are uh, full of hooey because you're gonna not only want one. Uh, but you're gonna be saying, no. I feel oh, like I, it's I like a one. dorky thing. Like, you, it, like I think the people who are gonna wear them are the people who bring their iPads to school and think they're so cool because they have their iPads at school. Y- you think so? Yeah. I'm I'm not convinced. I I think that 
Uh, although the Samsung I mean, it's watch not like it's off. not like people at school like even wear a f- wear a watch in the first place. I was at the AT and T store and I was checking out the Samsung watch, and the watch is pretty darn cool. You know, I, uh, what it can show you. It's it's not selling too too well. Big not you know. I mean, there are a lot of Samsung phones out there. It only works for certain ones. But uh, I think an iWatch uh, to be able to check your watch and see who's calling. Uh, read your text messages, uh, play music uh, via Bluetooth, uh, all sorts of stuff is, is pretty appealing. I think uh, I, I would be very interested in something like that. You wouldn't? So, Zoe, uh, can you do us a favor? One thing I want, you can take my phone if you could. So, Where's your drink? So I'm having trouble. I, just, I, w- I didn't bring it. <laughs> So I was having trouble uh, with my phone, and oh uh, yes, I will do this. Well, yeah, thanks. So the top button, the power button, you know, or to put it, it to sleep, lock the, button. I, the oh, lock it button, just works. Yeah, on on Pronounce on the it iPhone. Works. Yeah, but it, it, most of the time it doesn't. It Wait, doesn't what work. about what did didn't you go to the Apple Store? I did go to the Apple Store. What and did they say? They said, uh, go to the AT and T store. Why? They fixed my. I, I had like you, literally the exact same problem, but opposite. I had the. Round button. The, the difference is yours was under warranty. Mine, mine, my warranty has, uh, um, is no longer valid. Why not? But I thought you got like yours at the same time or like even later. Exactly. And you got it. You, you brought yours in before, uh, the year was, uh, year was before you had it for a year. And I mm. brought this in after, uh, so I can't, I can't shut the phone off and I'm, my battery power is going down and I want to put it to sleep. And Zoe and I were cruising around last night. She filled the tank up with gas. Yeah, she's yeah, pretty amazing there. Uh, and uh, came up with this solution. And tell us about uh, what, and you said a lot of your friends, uh, their button doesn't work on their iPhones as well. Is that right, Zoe? Yeah. Yeah. So tell us, what's, show us what's going on. Okay, so. We have a desk I, cam. Would that yeah. would that be would that be useful? I think there's one there. You guys have yeah. You got yeah. You guys yeah. have one. Set set the phone right down. I think if you just leave the phone in one place, that might help. Let's take a look and see if we can okay. do it. There you go. So as you can see, when you try to press the lock button, oh, it some it usually doesn't work. No, it doesn't. It's like usually. see now, oh, <laughs> well <laughs> that's awkward. Well, it usually see it didn't work that just then. So. You get, see this little thing, you see that thing in the corner, that little circle? So, if you want it, so that's like easy access and Did stuff. Did I see TED Talks? Probably, So, yeah. if you if you want right. to get this in the first place, you can go to settings, then you can go to general, then you can go to accessibility, and then if you go down, you can click on um, excessive touch, I think. Assistive. No, 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 it's not that. Which one was it? Maybe it is that. Yeah, it must be that. Okay, so then you put that on. So if you turn it off, yeah, it is that. So you want to click that on, and then you see that little thing pop up in the corner. So if you're on your phone and it won't shut off from the lock button, which happens to a lot of people, you can just click on this, and then this is what comes up in the first place. You can do many features on this, and um, it's really helpful. And it, So if you want to lock your phone... You can click on device, then you can click on the lock screen, and it locks your phone for you. So that so that that takes the place of the lock button yeah. or the power button on the top. And you of the can phone. also do like other things. You can put the volume up and down. Like if any button's broken, you can basically just do it from here. Can you power the phone off uh, with that? Is there an option um, for that? I don't know. I, don't I think saw so. more thing. More. Screenshot. You can screenshot things with this. That's really helpful too because you can't press this to screenshot things if it's broken. Right. So I, you can press uh, screenshot. Okay. Or sh- multitasking. So run through it real quick again. Exactly how we mm. get to the, how we find this uh, feature. Okay. So you just open the phone, and then you go into settings, which is just the normal settings, and then you go to your you click on general, which is just right here general, and then you click on um did i pass it oh accessibility which gets like a lot of things like like zoom text and larger text and all that and then oh, if you sorry. want this you can click on excessive touch so you Zoe, just try Zoe, to turn assistive. that on assistive, assistive not excessive assistive touch and then you turn it on 
and then that thing will just automatically pop up when the button when you switch the switch on and then it comes up and then if you want to lock your phone you just go to device lock screen thank you zoe and uh you did that whilst we were driving uh last night and thank you very much zoe uh officially i want to say to you uh happy 13th birthday happy 13th birthday oh you're hugging your sister Zoe, you that's so your nice last name. that's so I nice did. you guys oh, are yeah, sisters you don't look like sisters you got a blonde one and you got are you sure you are one of you adopted nothing wrong with that i was just curious all right zoe happy 13th you. birthday you okay. got a big party what's going on what time is it? what's going on at the party she's having her sweet 13. <laughs> As you like to say, let's get this party started. We're going to end... This is the biggest party I've ever had. Really? Like, I personally have. Like, I've been to, like, bomb mitzvah parties, which was by, by, by obviously bigger, but, yeah. That's not a birthday party. Well, yeah, but any party that yeah. I've had... And I'm feeling really old. What am I, a That's chaperone not. now or something? That's, no. That's crazy. Aren't okay. You? Bye. All right, we'll see you. We're going to end with the beginning and just wave to the kids around the world. Just wave and write into us at kidfriday.com. Go to kidfriday.com and write into us. And Hannah, if you just do a wave, we can close oh, this Hannah. show. We're just waiting Hannah. for you to, to uh, oh, what does that say? I, I can't see that. You probably can't read it because Hannah's handwriting right, well, is so bad. Well, no, it's because of the lighting. Ooh, I I know. That's a surprise. Okay. It's a mystery. All right, well, if you can You'll zoom in on it, you can check show. it out. And we'll see you in the next. Bye. Bye. Kid Friday. Yeah. Hit it. Hit it. Hit it. Let's get this party started. Yeah,